Welcome everyone to the premiere of the documentary, Lloyd Herman, The Accidental Curator. Wherever you might be, thank you for your interest in this presentation, which is being brought to you by Northwest Designer Craftsman and its Living Treasures Project. My name is Ron Pasco, and I had the pleasure of being co-chair with artist Linda Nino of the committee guiding this project. Some of you are probably not familiar with the Living Treasures Project, so I'll say a few words about it to start. It really starts with Northwest Designer Craftsman, which is a nonprofit juried arts organization that is celebrating its 65th birthday. Throughout those 65 years, its member artists and art advocates have worked to promote the understanding and appreciation of fine craft. They have done it through exhibitions of member artists' artwork at various galleries and museums lectures, workshops, and most recently a multi-day craft symposium. During the 1990s, it made what turned out to be a very significant decision, which was to begin the Living Treasures Project. The impetus for the project continues today, that is to create an ongoing series of video profiles documenting the Northwest's most influential, and important elder craft professionals, creating a record of their lives, of their work, and most importantly, of their achievements and contributions to the field. With the Lloyd Herman Project, it has now completed 10 video documentaries, all of which are available for viewing by the public on the NWDC YouTube page. Because the Living Treasures Project was self-funded, it had to deal with that monster in every nonprofit's closet, financial support. For that, we are not only grateful for the generous donations by Chris and Alita Latham, Dick Wilson, and the Renwick Alliance, but also to the 115 other individuals who donated to help support the documentary. I know that may include some of you out there today. So I say a special thanks to you and look for your name in the credits. We are also grateful for the generosity of Steve Jensen and Vincent Light, who opened up their home and studio for the performance art spectacle, Lloyd Apulusa, a fundraiser to help the project. This brought us to the making of the documentary we're going to see today. For that, we chose to partner with Fidget TV. If we look behind the curtain, we find that Fidget TV is actually a husband and wife team of John Forson and Gail Podrowski, who have spent the last 25 years in the video industry and brought a huge amount of talent to this project. And it's really their art that you'll see today. Now I'd like to invite Linda Nino to introduce John and Gail, then say a little bit about our fellow committee members, and finally introduce Peter Olson, the incoming chair of the Living Treasures Project. Okay, yes, Ron, thank you. Uh, he and I have shared the chair position for Lloyd's video. We wouldn't have been able to complete it without the help of our devoted committee. All are professional artists with expertise to share. And they are Gretchen Eccles, Larry and Liza Halverson, Lynn Hull, Cheryl Leo Gwynn, Larry Metcalf, Peter Olson, Kavita Subramanian, and Virginia Wyman. They've helped design fundraisers, created contracts, shared technological skills, kept track of our donors' information and contributions, kept lists, raised money, and did grunt work, and most of all, brought tasty treats to our meetings. They've helped us make decisions, have offered graphic skills, and most importantly, have shared in the work of creating a half hour made for TV video. I'd like to introduce Peter Olson now, who will be stepping into the chair role. He will be the lead in selecting the next subject. We're lucky to have been working with him this last year and find out just how capable he is. Peter? 
Well, thank you, Lynn. I really look forward to uh, stepping into this role. The Living Treasures films are a wonderful testament to the importance of fine craft in the Northwest. And I look forward to serving the committee in any way that I can to celebrate the import important artists of our region. Thank you. John and Gail, we're so pleased to have been working with you. Uh, say hello to our audience. Thank you, Lynn, and thank you to the Northwest Designer Craftsman. This has been such an honor to work with Lloyd um, on this project, and we're deeply grateful to the committee and all of the amazing artists um, and just um, really enjoyed this project. And we hope you enjoy watching it. We're sad that we can't have this beautiful film scene on the big screen, but uh, your YouTube opportunity is gonna be the next best opportunity, we're sorry. We're thrilled to have been able to work with Lloyd and look forward to having a live premiere in the spring. We're just so happy to be able to show you this video.